When we have like a, a multi-cluster control plane and something like we've done between the cloud and the edge, for example, what's the difference there? How is that supported with the different technologies that we pull together here? So multi-cluster is intended to be something that will have several clusters. And for each cluster, you will have a special separate dedicated control plane because yeah. the control plane is really limited to one single entity. That could be for our case, a cluster at this point it is really what is the boundary so if we have multiple clusters we will have multiple control planes there are ways like an example if you have been using eks or aks the abstraction layers that they created for us we will not have the control plane it's managed by the provider of the service you just use the nodes that are running the kubelets and the cube proxy on top of them and you don't see the control plane or masters they are just controlled by the provider how the provider is controlling that. They could have a sort of cluster, additional one, with multiple nodes, but having multiple control planes on top of a cluster of master nodes, and they will separate the offer. There are ways to split the control planes management on top of a cluster of nodes. So a pool of masters, maybe better to use the terminology pool in this case, pool of masters that are controlling several node groups that are controlled by a single control plane for each of the customers.